He's a foodie. And that is when we introduced him to one of our favorite chefs. Of course, we are talking about Gino from Donatello's. And both are back here in the kitchen with us today. Good morning, guys. Good morning. Yes, it's such a pleasure to be here with Gino. I, I this is going to be fun. Okay, is this your first cooking segment? <laughs> My first cooking segment on TV. I would say, you know what? Yes. This yes, is like breaking right ground here. right now. <laughs> I'm honored. Not, yes, first time. Well, thank I wanted you for to do having it only with back. the master chef, you know what I'm saying? God bless you. It's an honor. <laughs> so seriously, last time you were here in Tampa, yes. you went over to see Gino at his restaurant. Yes, I did. So that's how we kind of, uh, we thought, well, we need to have you back and actually see you guys in action together. And when Robert walked into the studio this morning, you were already giving him a hard time. I have to. Well, we're going to make one of the dishes <laughs> that you had in the restaurant that night yes, about a year ago. Delicious. And then the other one was a broccoli rob, which I made for you, uh -huh. the linguine, linguine oh, fini. Yes. With the broccoli rob, aglioli. Yo, yo, which I made for you last time when Robert was yeah. here, and then we showed a clip of you uh, have, enjoying have it in the restaurant. Yeah. yeah, that was fun. So well, it's good to have us too. here uh, together. You have today. quite the audience today. I see that. <laughs> I like it. Well, thank you for. Well, the veal milanese is my favorite. Is that my your favorite? favorite yes. Yeah, I love that. Uh, so this is your first time cooking friend. in our studio, in our kitchen, no, maybe on TV. But do you cook TV. much at home? I cook a little bit, not much, but okay. I can. Okay. I've been known to kind of, you know, destroy some food. <laughs> I like it. That means eating it and cooking it at the same time. Well said. So what you making? What are we doing So we're here? making a little milanese, okay? What we have here is a nice thin pounded, not thin enough apparently. <laughs> I show Real it now? Milanese. Yeah, go ahead. All right. this, is a, this is an already breaded product that we're going to get in our uh, this in is the, the pan veal. so we can have it uh, Now I cooking. told Gino that I would pound this a little thinner. You have to pound that's the, right. you have to pound so the, the, the heck out of your veal. Well, I mean, I like, like it, nice it a little thin. bit meaty, but you know, you know, Robert likes it a little bit thin. We're I like it very thin. Back and forth like this all day, okay? Well, this is you know why? Because I came from a Sicilian family that was poor. They had to make it stretch, so they pounded the meat out. <laughs> There's a reason for everything. Right? I, I understand. So I got used to eating it like that. <laughs> I gotta say, so, this might be the easiest yeah. interview for Carly and I. Know. We're just you guys back, take it you away. Know, Robert's, Robert's gonna put in the pan. We just have a little bit of oil, a little bit of butter. Uh, Robert is uh, dipping the veal, just dusting a little bit with flour. It helps the egg stick to stick. the uh, meat. Go ahead, and that's good. Just give it a little shake off there you get a little shake off and then right in the egg perfect in the meantime here we got if a he nice browning doing a going good job would you let him know I, you better believe it <laughs> <laughs> he would do the same for me yes also. he would Absolutely. okay give it a flip over i good seen my mother and grandmother make this a thousand times in the egg we put a little bit of salt a little bit of pepper a little bit of parsley some uh, parmesan cheese did we do already that we did we put all that in it's okay. all here um and then yep Get a little bit of moisture on it. Over here, now the Milanese is named Milanese because it's original from Milano. I actually remember the first time I had one was uh, in Milano in the uh, Galleria with my father. I was probably seven Aww. years old in Italy, Milano. We were in between flights. So we had all day in Milan and relaxed. And Aww. Well, probably about they six years old, my grandmother. Made the Sicilian style, which is a little different because we add a little bit of garlic. That's right. Bread crumbs. We've been, uh, you know, just thinking of which way is the right way, going back and I, forth I, on I, that. I just like but the Parmesan cheese. Yes. Yeah, throw a little more Parmesan on top I'm of that. I'm just sitting okay. back. Okay. Like, okay. You know what? So, yeah, TV show. Like, Carly I think and I. you guys may be going to the Food Network <laughs> after this. Carly, we're going to sit back. We're going to pour some wine. Please, would you pour us all a little there bit of wine? There you go. All right. So thank then, you. There you go. There we go. We got it uh, breaded. Give it a little, make sure everything sticks, and then we'll put some markings on it. Helps Why do you it not, put the markings? Well, it helps it not separate. The breading come off of the, off of the meat. So let's take a look and see how we're doing here. I think that looks... That's golden that look? brown. That, that look looks beautiful. Right? Beautiful. Yeah, we're doing okay? Perfect. Well, While you're doing that, I do want to find out, Robert, why you're back in town. We love when you're well, here, but I'm tell here. us what you've been up to. Well, uh, again, uh, Eddie and uh, Candy DeBartolo are friends of mine, mm -hmm. and uh, they invited me to their foundation that their daughters run, uh, Melissa, mm -hmm. uh, not Melissa, uh, their daughters run. And um, uh, so I came here for the first time to, uh, you know, uh, support that foundation. Yeah. It's a great uh, thing to have a big gala. Mm -hmm. I also did go to Candy's restaurant, The Sacred Pepper, which is, besides Donatello's, one of my favorite places to go. Mm -hmm. Good, good. Yes. Yeah, yeah isn't it a great family? Yes. They're yeah, a great family. Agreed. Salute. Salute. Cheers. Senza fine. You know what that means? Right. With no end. With no end. Yes, sir. Senza fine. <laughs> Instead of Cendani, yeah. we say Senza fine because a lot of people are reaching 100, so 100 years you want to go Senza fine. All right. So are we done here as we 
The, I know yes. we want to drink, so, but we got to finish food, cooking. <laughs> the Milanese is served many different ways. Now it's you a nice tell wine. Me, what is it? That's a Monsanto. It's a nice light Tuscan. Light. I mean, it's early in the morning. Yeah, you know, we're perfect. not having anything heavy. <laughs> Still a so Chianti. <laughs> now, I wake up to this. What is this? Should okay, I be getting now, on this? So the Milanese, got a minute yeah. left. So let's do a little bit of this. A little salt. Okay. Okay. A little pepper. Now, Roberto, I believe you like yours just like that. I just with like a little it. lemon juice, right? Yes. So the Milanese then is served many different ways with a little bit of lemon yes just like that just mm. like that and a little touch of salt at the end mm -hmm. uh, of course always look at that okay and or you we do it also with a little insalata tricolore mm -hmm. which is our uh, mixture of onion mm -hmm. and uh, yeah. No, no, give me the little piece. The little piece. I want <laughs> the little piece. Let's try a piece already. <laughs> no, 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 we have about 30 thing. seconds left. Okay, yeah. I got it. Little, of course you got it. I mean, we don't have a half hour. Onion. <laughs> So, oh, guys, well, looking forward, so while like Robert is diving in, Gino, you always come back to our show. Can we make mm. this an annual, I know. An annual cooking segment? What do you think, <laughs> gentlemen? I think so. You think this is a good thing? I think we have to have a, uh, an anniversary. It. I like that plan. Again, if the Food Network doesn't snatch them up first, then they get their own no, show. Take them. Delicious. <laughs> Again. Take them. The veal is so tender. Thank you. And the flavors of the Parmesan cheese. I'm just missing a little bit of that garlic that I like. Oh, here we go again. Oh, he's never on gonna it. He's end. On well, again, salute, gentlemen. Enjoy the rest of your time here so in the delicious. Bay Area. Yeah. Thank you, girls. Thank you, Gino.